Okay, so we are now going to be doing part two of getting the new mythical epic Polar Tide, the one released for December 2023, and I expect that we will be able to get it today. It We only need uh, four more items in total, so let's just go ahead and try to find them in Skywatch. I'm not going to go in the same order because I'm going to try to do as little battles as I can since we don't uh, need to do really any battles hopefully we only need two more from skywatch so we just need to find them in these openables hopefully we don't get like super unlucky and don't get any of them at all that would be terrible means we would have to wait quite a bit longer i already delayed this by one day because i just didn't have the time to do it the previous day so we're just gonna do this now we have to do that battle hopefully we get something from still nothing okay we don't have too many options left we have to do this battle okay hopefully we get one from here okay great we got ourselves a snow globe now we only need one more and that is great so let's go find it hopefully we don't have to do another battle because there are a couple here that we shouldn't have to do battles for, such as this one. Let's see if we can get it from here. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, no. We have about, I think, three more left to open. Let's see. Hopefully we can get around this monster right here. I believe we can. There we go. And yes, we got our fourth or our fifth snow globe. Now we have completed this task, and we're going to go trade with Ula. She is in Skywatch, just where we were, but all the way up here. Snow globe description. Snow falls in the snow globe even when sitting still. Pretty cool. So we're going to click track mythic, because of course that's what you do when you trade your quest items. And so now we can do the battle, but I'm going to finish up the cold fur first so that we can do both battles at the same time. Let's do both of these. There we go. And let's see how far we can. We can't avoid this. We can avoid this one, though. But of course, we don't get anything. Expect that we will be able to. It just might take a little bit. And yeah, I do not think our luck is going to be bad enough to not get any. Okay, yes. There we go. One cold fur. We just need one more. Depends on where we can. We always have to do that battle. It's unfortunate that a monster spawns there. Uh, can we avoid this one? I think we can if we go around to the side and open it here. There we go. Yes, and we got our cold fur. We can avoid that battle, so that's a nice tip if you need it. You can avoid that if it's right there if you're really careful so we're going to finish trading with ula cold fur quest description this tuft of fur somehow feels frozen yet soft it is part of polar tides uh, coat of fur so yeah that's just how it is so now we can do both taming battles we are about to get polar tide so let's go ahead and go to Shivertail Mountains and track it so that we can do our taming battles and finish obtaining Polar Tide. So there it is in all its glory. I, again, I really like this one, like I said in part one. I really like all of them. And we put on uh, two fire mythical epics just to give ourselves some advantage against polar tide so that maybe we don't have to do as many questions or turns to take it out yeah it definitely helps a lot if you have uh what's strong against the element i don't have anything on that for my wizard i ha i didn't change that just love that polar tide attack animation it's literally a snow version of riptides so cool instead of water it's snow that is brought up and it's like that in the walk animation too we'll see that once we get it we have one battle left to do now 
Let's go ahead and immediately do that. It's in the same spot. So let's, there it is. There we go, final taming battle. We're gonna just do this quite quickly. So Pirate Isle, you get your turn. Eruption, it's gonna do a lot of damage. 661. Now it is Solar's turn. It can do Fireball. 490 damage. It's gonna go the same as the previous battle. Wizard can cast Astral Storm. It's the exact same as the last battle, that's how it works. I know Polar Tide has like really good spells. Okay, so Pirate Isle is gonna finish it off with Conflagration. And now we are about to get Polar Tide. Finally, we've waited eight months. Polar Tide has been obtained. The pet is members only, the buddy is not for whatever reason. I still don't know why the mythical epic buddies are not marked members only, but it's not really that important. So Polar Tide has been obtained, really happy about that. We like to get these mythical epics as soon as we can. So it's been number 209, the description reads, Polar Tide stays hidden during the warmer months, only to emerge once temperatures reach the point of freezing. So yes, it is. I know its lore has a lot to do with it uh, trying to stay cold and like needing ice to survive or to just thrive in general. Let's see, we got it at level 92. Let's click on it and just, just admire the polar tide that we have just received. It is going to take 6,460 uh, gold to level it up to level 100. Of course, I am okay with making that commitment. I've already got, I've got 1,309,597. I can spare 6,000. There we go. It's at level 100. And so its stats at level 100 sorry are quite good 750 a health 380 speed 470 power and 760 defense that defense is quite high it's a pet based on health and defense so let's add it to our team because we're going to go battle with it we're going to see what its spells are like i said before i know they're pretty good so and it does have the mythical epic attack uh, glacier for ice. We just don't know why Shimmerstorm did not have Ion Cannon. So it has glacier, of course, most powerful ice spell for mythical epics and epics only. We have swing, a really good physical spell. Spear sickles, a nice spell. And s <coughs> sorry, sorry again, <coughs> sorry again about that. And sever, another really good. Uh, physical spell so it's got great spells like two amazing physical spells so yes that's what we like to see out of a mythical epics yeah sorry about that I'm, I'm just a little bit sick so don't mind any of that so let's equip it it'll be quite farther down there it is behind griff topis because remember, they were leaked at around the same time, and it's been eight months since they were leaked. Yes, I really like that walk animation. The snow uh, coming up behind it. Of course, it's perfect for Shivertail Mountains, too. So, yeah. There we go. We have obtained Polar Tide. What do you think about Polar Tide, Prodigy's newest mythical epic? Have you received it yet? Or are you still working on the quest items? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comments.